In this video, I'm going to show you Sours getting teamed on by Sway and Whistles, Sway and Whistles' response to the incident, as well as Innocent admitting to teaming with Assault on a regular basis. In our first clip, we're watching Sours spectate the point of view of Sway. Sours is the female luchador, Sway is the dark bomber, and Whistles is the female referee. Say it ain't so, brothers. In the video, you're going to see Sway have a clear shot at Whistles, but instead of taking it, both of them decide to team up onto Sours. He was literally trying to help. And then he was like, oh shoot. He, I, he's like, I got him, I got him. Get away, go, go, get away from me. Oh, okay, I'll see you later, bro. Good luck, have fun. They have clout, so there's no point in reporting them, but. Here's Sway's response to the situation and his explanation as to why he was teaming with Whistles during the encounter. Whistles responded in the comments of Sway's tweet. Here's what he had to say. In the comments of Sway's post, another pro player, Innocence, admitted to also regularly teaming in solo cups with his duo's partner, Assault. Here's what he had to say. Earlier today, Ninja gave his thoughts on the situation, and Innocence responded with his justification as to why he thinks it's okay that him and Assault regularly team. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I personally am not a fan of the teaming that appears to be regularly going on in solo cups. I think it's really unfair for anyone who doesn't have a professional duo's partner in their lobbies. Um, it's something Epic should definitely step in and do something about. I would like to see longer bans and harsher punishments for people who decide to team in solo cups. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you'd like to be notified of future videos, please click that bell icon. Thanks for watching. Take care. Have a good day.